Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm actually going to be cutting a wax pie in front of you guys. Now this is an older pie and this is by The Scented Princess um, and I have had this in the vault for quite some time now. Um, so I mean fall is just around the corner. It has definitely had time to cure So I decided that I was just going to be cutting it and I asked you guys if you wanted me to cut it in front of you on Instagram And most of you said yes, so I thought that I would do that for you guys today So this is what the pie looks like Now the scented princess is not um, in business anymore She used to be an excellent wax vendor uh, let me see if I can just kind of show you guys the pie up close a little bit better. There we go. She used to be an excellent wax vendor and she went out of business, unfortunately, but she used to make these beautiful pies and beautiful wax loaves and they were just simply gorgeous. And I believe I was gifted this one by somebody, but it is in the scent. Let's see if we can see this here. Okay, it is in the scent wildberry mousse zucchini and zucchini is a fall fragrance to me definitely it is something that um i only melt in the fall or in the winter it is definitely a bakery scent as well so what utensils do i have today here um i have my pamper chef blade which i will show you guys here that is what this looks like it is just your basic blade to I don't know probably cut food or whatever because it's from the pampered chef but um, different sites that make wax loaves and things like that different vendors also carry this on their website it's not made by the pampered chef but it is by somebody else so this is definitely a possibility for you guys to get and then I also have just a regular knife that is a smooth type of edge it's not jagged at all so I'm gonna be using that and then I don't know if these are the right bags probably not but I do plan on using this wax um this whole pie up for the fall so I'm not going to be storing this in these bags for long but I did buy these bags from the Dollar Tree and I just thought that they were really pretty and this is what I'm going to use so I'm gonna open these up real quick and I'm not real sure actually how I'm going to be cutting this, but this is what the bag looks like here. I'm not real sure how I'm going to be cutting this pie. I've cut loaves in the past. Pies are a little different story for me just because, I don't know. I think I've cut a pie before, but I just don't remember like how I did it. So basically what you want to do is you want to take the pie out and oh my, look at that. So we have purple underneath that was a surprise my friends so very very pretty i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to try to get the embeds off of here first and we will put the embeds in a bag so um then that way we will just have them separate and her embeds are harder than the regular wax is for the pie so let's just take these out real quick they should just pop right off, which they are. They're little like ice cream scoops. Super cute. And then she also has embeds in here that are just blocks of wax, as you can see. And we're just gonna keep those in there, I think. Okay, so everything is kind of like jagged on the top, which I really don't like, but whatever. So let me put these little chunks here in the tin and save these for later. There they are. And then we will start cutting into our, our little pie here. So I don't really know how I'm gonna do this. I think I'm just gonna cut it in half first and we'll see what happens. So here we go. And as you can see, her wax is super smooth on the top, a little bit harder as we go down. This is gonna be a two hand job. Oh, there we go. Okay, so it is cut through. And now let's take a look in the middle and see what we got. So this is what we have here, you guys. Okay, so we have the whipped kind of wax on the top and a harder chunky wax on the bottom that is kind of an off yellow now, probably because the wax is kind of old, and a purple. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this fluffy type of wax off first, and then 
we will deal with the bottom. So let's do this first. By the way, this mat is from the Dollar Tree, just an FYI. Oh, how am I gonna do this? This is like slippery, slippery, slopity. Let's go like this. Well, no, let's go like this. Um, and you can get these mats, like I said, at the Dollar Tree. They're super inexpensive, obviously only a dollar, and I use them just for wax cutting only. Okay, so this came off super easy, like that. And then I'm just gonna basically cut these into little chunks. Let me put this flat here. It's probably gonna be easier. And I'm sure you guys are gonna critique how I'm doing this. Angela, it's too messy. Angela, what are you doing with yourself? Angela, that's not how we would cut our wax. Oh well, fuck off. This is how I'm doing it. So basically you just wanna chunk it up into you know, little pieces that you would use for your wax warmer. And what I'm gonna do is probably take these um, softer pieces here first and put these in one bag and then the harder wax, um, which is the dark purple here, I will put in a separate bag along with the ice cream cones. Okay, so this soft wax is going to be put in this bag. And then let me do the same over here to this one. I don't know why you guys, I just find this like super relaxing. It's relaxing, I can chat with you guys, we can talk about our day. Today I only worked a half day at work um, and it was a hectic day. We were so busy and I mean, my job that I have, I don't know, some of you guys know what I do for a living, but some of you don't and I really don't share that on my channel, but it can kind of be a little stressful at times. Um, so it's kind of nice just to come home and relax and I'm gonna be taking care of my mom's dog this week so that will be interesting she's actually going on a trip so okay oh my gosh my hands you guys are filled with wax I'm just gonna rinse them off here real quick my sink is like right behind me get some of those chunks off of there okay and let's see so these bags came with these little twisty ties so i'm going to just take one of the twisty ties and like i said you guys can order your bags from wax vendors it's up to you a lot of wax vendors have um you know their wax bags or whatever on their website like i said that's up to you okay so all of this soft wax is in this bag and i think it looks a-okay okay now let's go onto this harder stuff. I'm gonna try to cut it with my knife. If that doesn't work, then I'll have to use the Pampered Chef blade. Um, but like I said, this is, oh yeah, it still works. It's just a little bit harder. What's harder are these chunks in here, as you guys can see. Okay, let's see what we got. There we go. I'm just gonna cut them into probably like this size. I feel like this size is fine. Um, this can be used as a blender or you could just use like two or three of those chunks if you want in your warmer. There we go. By the way, if you guys like these type of videos, um, I don't know, like this video. Like, like it, like it like it like it thumbs up this video if you like it and if you want me to do more because i used to do these a long time ago and i just haven't recently oh my gosh look at all this wax oh my goodness okay we're almost done you guys and by the way this smells absolutely amazing if you have ever had wild berry mousse I like it. I also feel like zucchini is kind of like patchouli in a way. I feel like a lot of people love patchouli and a lot of people can't stand patchouli. I feel like zucchini is the same way. Either you absolutely love it or you can't stand it. And I went through a period of time where I loved it. 
I went through a period of time where I was just like, Angela, I am, I am like zucchini moosed out. Definitely zucchini moosed out. But I feel like for some odd reason, I could get back into it. I don't know. I'm super excited for the fall fragrances to come out. I don't know when this video is going to post. Wouldn't it be funny if I posted it today? Let's do that, you guys. Let's post this video. Let's post this video today. So today is, what is today? Today is Wednesday, July 12th, and there's no Angela and Judy show going up today, so let's post it today. That'll be kind of exciting. Kind of like a live video. I don't know. There we go. Okay, now, yes, it looks like a complete fucking disaster. It looks like I murdered it. But that's what happens with the softer wax. It's going to look like that. And I mean, really, who cares? You're just melting it anyway. It doesn't matter what it looks like, right? I mean, some people care, I guess. I don't know. The harder wax, I feel, is more pretty after it's cut. The soft wax, it's like ugh, you have a big glob kind of of a mess. Oh my gosh, my whole house is going to smell like zucchini bread. <gasps> yes. So good. Okay, so there is my bag. As you guys can see, there is a lot in there. Okay, let me get my twisties. Thank goodness I took pictures of this um, before I cut it open. And I also have another pie that I can show you guys. So like I said, if you like this video, definitely comment down below, thumbs up this video, let me know, and I will do more. So there you go. There are my two full bags, huge bags, of wild berry mousse zucchini. Absolutely amazing. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all later. Bye, everyone.